Familiar is a close friend or a spirit in the shape of a cat, bird or other animal that is the close companion of a witch. Hello everybody, hello and welcome to Pixel Wales. My name is Jake and I am the community manager here at Pixel Wales headquarters. Today this video is going to be a tutorial for our latest update that is going to go live like two hours after this video is in YouTube. But uh, in this video you can find all the necessary information about our familiars. According to Cambridge Dictionary, familiar is a close friend or a spirit in the shape of a cat bird or other animal that is the close companion of a witch. As you guys can see from this and hear from that is that uh, these familiars are uh, more or less like pets. So yeah, uh, with familiars you can have them around with you all the time, you can evolve them, you can name them, you can see their age, uh, you can level them up and today I'm going to show you guys how this is possible and how you can do that where you can get familiars and how they are going to work that leveling up and evolving. Let's go and jump into the game and I'm going to show you guys the first familiar that you can get from our daily bonus. So here we can see I'm entering daily bonus all right um, um, and I am in the development environment so that's why there are nobody else in here uh, and I have like 100,000 gems like you can see. Uh, you can see on the left side here. So, grand prize is this kind of fellow, and uh, this is called the Ninja Pickle. You can only get this uh, Ninja Pickle from the VIP daily bonus. There is no other way to get it. Well, of course, you can trade it from other people as well. I'm really excited to see what kind of uh, Ninja Pickle names you will uh you will get for these guys but let's go inside my world trailer world and let's talk about more of these familiars and how they work and where can you get the other ones so let's go trailer world all right and let's hit enter as you can see from the left side here we are in the development environment but first let's go inside the shop i'm gonna show you guys this oh I want to mention we've added a little bit more gems to our box of gems, huge pile of gems and pile of gems from 50% more gems to 60% more gems. So if you are looking to buy some gems for yourself, now is a great time to do so. This is like a limited time offer right now. But let's go and check out the item packs and here I'm going to press, as you guys can see, familiars. Right now there are four different familiars that you can start with and each one of these you can level up and evolve like you can see and read from here. Familiars can be leveled up and evolved into higher forms. Egg growth time one day. So for example uh, we're gonna buy this bunny familiar today and uh, show you guys how it's going to grow and everything else. So familiars can be leveled up and uh, then evolved into higher tier, higher forms. Egg growth time one day and it costs for 35,000 gems. So it is not cheap, but uh, that is made so that it is a little bit more rare to get a pet and you have to actually work for it and you won't be able to get it like right away and everybody has some pets in it. Even though there are like four different starting familiars, you can evolve these into multiple different ones. So even though there are four right here, I think there are more than 20 forms for each of these combined. So there are a lot of choices what pet you want to have. For example, if I remember correctly, you can uh, evolve Gremlin like five different times and uh, multiple different forms from that and at some cases you have to decide do you want to go uh, to the left side or to the right side with the evolves. You cannot go back so you have to kind of choose what kind of form type you want for your gremlin or for your bunny, crow, mini bot or whatever but you guys will be able to see this. I'm gonna buy a familiar right now so buy bunny familiar. I'm gonna buy that right now so yes thank you very very much I got a white bunny oh yeah thank you white bunny egg now uh, I'm gonna take this white bunny egg I can place it down like any other uh, seed like normally and then it's going to be here Bloop. and white bunny egg it's going to grow for 24 hours so either I can wait for that 24 hours or I can actually take the fertilizers that I have 
collected, you can just uh, get fertilizer with mobile phone to watch ads or buy them with gems. So let's actually try to grow this tree fertilized. I'm going to be fertilizing it uh, 24 times. So as you guys can see, it will start to grow. And these are different uh, grow steps for these. One more. 59 minutes. Bong. Thank you. And tree fertilized. And now it's ready. Now we can harvest it. So let's pop it out. And there we go. I think that's a cute one. So let's pick it up. And now we have ourselves our own white bunny. Age 8 seconds. So if we right click the bunny with PC or just uh, tap and hold with mobile phones, we can open up this, so it has info, trash, drop, of course, info, and familiar. So I'm gonna show you this, guys. The info, uh, it's a little bunny, uh, progenitor of bunny family tree. Mm -hmm. So bunny family tree, so that is the first uh, bunny that you can get, and there it evolves into higher tiers and higher forms. Cannot be crossbred. All right, so let's take a look at the familiar. What does that do? So here you can feed it, you can see the level of the bunny, what is the race, uh, what is its age and what it eats. So you can feed these bunnies to get them to higher level and then when they are at level 5 their name will turn golden and then you can evolve them. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do this in this video. So uh, first let's choose a name for our bunny, so you're gonna be Bugs. Bugs Bunny. <laughs> so, Bugs Bunny is going to be a good one. I'm gonna hit enter. And are you sure you want to name this familiar Bugs Bunny? This name cannot be changed later. So, yes. This will be the first bunny that you will get. And this will be the last time you will be naming it. Uh, you can hit cancel and uh, accept. So, Bugs Bunny, you cannot change it. It's gonna be Bugs Bunny for the last rest of his life. Alright, so next, um, it's still level 1, each 2 minutes. I would like to have it level 5, because in order for us to evolve that, we need to get it to level 5. And we need to e feed it some blue cookies. So as we can see, each blue cookie needs one for the next level. So, we need to get a familiar food machine. There is only one way to get it, and that is to crossbreed it. It's the only tier 9 item in the game right now. Of course, on top of the um, Evolverator. That's how you pronounce it, probably. I'm gonna take a Maneki Neko seed. Uh, that's a tier 8 item, and then an old TV. And as you guys will be able to see, all right, cross-spread into FFM, and uh, that is a familiar food machine, and five days it takes to grow. Right now, this is the familiar food machine tree. I'm gonna be collecting that, thank you very much. Right, FFM, and let's place it down. Here you guys can see the familiar food machine. With Familiar Food Machine, you can either buy food for your familiar or you can actually like create it as well. So let's check out how that works. Right, so this is the blue cookie that we can feed for our Bugs Bunny, our bunny. So you can either just buy it now, right now, from for 1200 gems or you can also produce that. So you would need like 200 soil blocks, 100 granite. Uh, blocks and also 200 uh, cave backgrounds. You can collect these and you can create these. You can even, of course, you can sell these. Like, if you cannot afford a familiar in this case, maybe a way for you to create a lot of profits in this update is to create different kind of foods, farm these foods and sell them to the guys who need them and then you will have enough wealth to actually buy yourself your own, own familiar as well. But let's, for example, let's hit the produce so, are you sure you want to spend the resources and start producing blue cookie? Yes, produce! And here we go, and it will start to produce that blue cookie, and it is going to take uh, one hour to finish up. You can also finish this now for like 198 gems, that is what we are going to do right here. So, are you sure you want to produce blue cookie immediately for 198 gems? Yes. 
production complete and then collect. Of course, you can have multiple familiar food machines in your world and use all of them. So you don't have to wait for this one to get another one cooking, but you can like create multiple different ones and then cook them uh, differently and then sell them or feed them to your familiar. So yeah, let's go and feed this. So you cannot feed it from the cookie, you have to go and uh, tap your white bunny or whatever the familiar might be and then tap it and familiar, click that and now we can feed it and now we can just, oh thank you and it's going to eat that and it's gonna be level 2, thank you very much and uh, now we have just 3 more levels to go through. Uh, what I'm going to do in this video, I'm going to actually buy these blue cookies that we need in order to evolve that bunny into the next level. And now we got 14 cookies and let's go and tap that once again familiar and then we're gonna start feeding that. Thank you. Feeding it a little bit more. Here on the bottom you can see that you have eight right now and this is going to be the last level we are feeding it. We're feeding it and uh, here we go. Take this familiar to an evolverator to evolve it to its next form. You can see this from this plus right here. So our white bunny or Bugs Bunny is now ready to be evolved. At the same time as you guys can see uh, when he is level 5 his name will turn golden like uh, he has a VIP for himself. You can also use its custom emoticon. Each and every pet has its own unique expression that you can uh, that you can use and have. So the next thing that we need um, is that evolverator. Uh, that we read from our familiar info. So how are we gonna get it? That is also a cross printable item from tier 9 and uh, you're going to need a flat screen TV seed. So let's hit that and you can see here it grows and also what you're gonna need is a microwave. You can use a flat screen TV and a microwave to create an evolverator. That sounds a little bit um, dangerous for our familiar, but hey, <laughs> crossbred into evolverator. Right, it's going to grow for 10 days. I'm going to use uh, some of my fertilizer to grow it right now, and we'll be coming back when it's ready. All right, all right. So here we go, an evolverator that you get from that tree. All right, so. Let's uh, wrench it and let's show how this goes. So Evolverator, when you open it up, it automatically shows you all your pets. And uh, it shows that plus icon on the top right if it's available for evolution, so to speak. So now we can see that um, Evolve cost is going to be 9000 gems and you need to have this in order for you to get this evolved. I'm gonna be pressing that because I want to evolve it and are you sure you want to spend 9000 gems to start evolving Tummy Bunny? All right, our white bunny is going to become a Tummy Bunny. Here we can see um, how it's gonna change. Tummy Bunny is going to have a red tummy. It has more um, evolutions after that. So we're gonna evolve it and then we're gonna finish it for now uh, just to show you guys how this goes. So yes, I'm going to evolve it. Evolution complete, evolving complete, I'm sorry. Then collect and oh yeah, thank you. And uh, right now you will also get an achievement right here. So produce familiar food 50 times and that's a VIP quest. Also Evolverator, evolve two familiars. I've actually tried this once before. So you will also get VIP time when you first time do these evolves. Um, that's a very good thing. So you will have a chance to get that ninja pickle for yourselves as well. So and let's actually claim that. Thank you very much. And right now, um, this is our Tommy Bunny, and here you can see the name Bugs Bunny, level 1. Let's click it, and Bugs Bunny, thank you very much. Familiar info, now we can see that it eats yellow candy. And now if we check out the evolve cost, it's going to be 15,000 gems, and uh, it's going to turn red all over. So that's how you can level them up with food using familiar food machine. Then you can also evolve them using the evolverator once they are at level 5. 
uh, you will get a custom expression for each and every one. You can rename them. Age will be a good thing to show to your friends as well. And in the future, there will be more pets. Uh, we might be adding some new evolves to existing pets. I wanted to say you guys before I go today um, about our next update and that is going to come out w about one month from now and it is going to be about PvP. So PvP update is coming next. That's all I'm going to say about that right now, but it's going to be the next one. Thank you guys for being here today. I am Jake and uh, I'll see you guys in Pixar Worlds.